Hello everyone. In this video, we will study how to install SAP GUI. Yes, but in the projects, we already have SAP GUI available. So we can directly start working with the help of that. And in the previous video, we studied, we have three types of SAP GUI. SAP GUI for Windows, SAP GUI for Java, SAP GUI for HTML. Now we will go for installation, how to install SAP GUI for Windows. We will cover in this video because I have Windows operating system. So once you have the setup of SAP GUI, you can simply extract that setup. Suppose I will extract that setup. It will take some time to extract that setup. So you can see after extracting, I got a folder win32. You can go to that folder. There you have SAP GUI setup. You can simply, simply click on to that. It will ask for the permission. You can give the permission. And you can see. We are clearly getting a pop-up. Yes, you are installing SAP GUI for Windows. I'll go for next. I will select all. I will go for next. Yes. Now here it is saying the path that your SAP GUI will store into which particular path. C drive program files SAP front end. If you can see as of now, if I will show you the path, we have programs file x86. Now here in this here, it will go like here the front end will go here. We will get a folder of front end. Suppose if I will go for next. Now it is installing SAP GUI for Windows. So it is installing the various components. Meanwhile, I will show you my desktop also. As of now on my desktop, nothing is available. Once installation will be done, I will get a SAP GUI. You can see installation done and now you can see I have a SAP GUI, SAP logon pad is there and you can see in the C drive, I'll say program files x86 in SAP folder. Now we have a new folder front end. If your SAP logon pad or SAP GUI is not appearing, then what you can do, you can simply go for front end. You can go to SAP GUI and you will find there and you can move on to your desktop. So what you can do, you can simply right click and you can send to desktop. Yes. Now you can see we have SAP GUI for Windows is there. Once I will double click, you will simply see one pop up will come for SAP GUI for Windows. If I will double click. You can see it is clearly saying SAP GUI for Windows. So this is the way if you have the setup of SAP GUI, you can install SAP GUI. If you have the Windows operating system in this video, we covered about Windows operating system. Now in the next video, we will study how to add the server here, how to add the SAP server 
into this SAP logon pad so that we can connect to that SAP server. So you can clearly, clearly see this SAP GUI is on our presentation layer, presentation server. This is our local desktop. And with the help of that, we will connect to the SAP server. We will access the various SAP applications. In the next video, we will add the server into this SAP logon pad and we will connect to that SAP server. So that's it in this video. Thank you.